Hey YouTube, Ivy Figs here. Welcome to today's episode of Male Mania, kind of. Today we are doing things a little bit differently. We're trying something new over on our Instagram page at IBFigsNZ. Link down below and cut up there if we can. We are only showing the full episode of today's Male Mania over on our Instagram. Um, I will explain it all after this next clip. Trust me. Um, you want to go over there if you're a massive WWE figure collector like myself, you get a lot of enjoyment. But today, what we're showing you on this YouTube video, it, uh, and of course it's worth watching this as well, we are going over most or some of the figures that we unboxed in the episode. So here is a quick run over on that and I'll catch up with you afterwards. Here we go, keep in mind everything I'm about to show you isn't even all that we unboxed in the Instagram video, we are missing 6 of the figures plus a special package sent by Matt Cardona slash Zack Ryder himself. Let's get into it, a quick look at some of the items that we unboxed in that video, you definitely want to check that out for all figure collectors, we have the Elite Network Spotlight Series Matt Hardy, Target exclusive I believe. This one I think is a Walmart exclusive, the Royal Rumble Macho King Randy Savage Man. That pink will definitely stand out amongst all the other Macho Man figures. We have Elite Series 16, Ezekiel Jackson, definitely not an easy one to come by nowadays. We have the WrestleMania 29 Toys R Us exclusive. CM Punk based off the masterpiece that he had against Undertaker that year. We have the WrestleMania 30. Toys R Us exclusive, Daniel Bryan, obviously everyone knows uh, what moment that is from. We have the Elite Series 15, Rey Mysterio, one that I've been chasing for such a long time. What a beauty. Um, we have another beauty right here, Series 65 Collector's Edition, Walmart exclusive, Sensational Cherry right there. Um, this may very well be my favourite out of all of these. It is the WrestleMania 28 Toys R Us exclusive HBK Shawn Michaels. Literally been chasing that one ever since it came out. This one, my most sentimental purchase I've perhaps ever made. If you want to know why, check out the video. I go way more in depth on that one. It is a basic pay-per-view series 3 Royal Rumble CM Punk. Why is a basic the most sentimental one? It's actually quite a funny story. You want to listen to that if you're curious. Another one very sentimental which I kind of go over in the video also. Million Dollar Man Ted DiBiase. Sound still works. What an awesome figure. And these last two that I'll show you are kind of more new figures compared to the rest. We have Elite Series 77. Miss Elizabeth and Viscera, both awesome figures in their own right. Great job by Mattel on these. There we go, hope you enjoyed that. If you are a big WWE figure collector, you definitely want to go see the full thing. There is definitely a lot that you could miss out on by not watching it. Check it out again down in the link below. Now, why have we done it like this today? Um, now, it's been something that I've been kind of wrestling with for a while now. Um, going back, looking at the stats on YouTube, I, of course, really appreciate all of your support. I wouldn't be doing these videos if you guys didn't watch them. But looking at the stats, um, Male Mania videos, of course, there are a lot of you out there who enjoy those videos, and I enjoy making them for you. Um, but, uh, statistically, they're probably, uh, the least viewed or, um, yeah, the viewer retention on that isn't the best, and that is, I feel like, a reflection on my part, um, the quality of the video, nothing to do with you guys, um, so I've really been wrestling with this thought for a while, I've been sitting on these clips uh, for many months, even just before we moved house, uh, it's been that long that I've been sitting on these clips trying to figure out the best way to bring these to you, I feel like we've been doing it this way long enough now, the whole building up clips and then uploading it. I feel like there's probably a better way to do it. Um, now, this is where I need your help. Um, now, in, on this channel, I never um, give myself credit for anything. It's always us. I always refer to it as us. We did this. We did that. And 
that is because this channel is a team effort. Um, yeah, we wouldn't be doing this right now if it weren't for all of you guys. Um, yeah, I, I did it again. I said we. <laughs> um, yeah, that's a perfect example. Um, now, this is where you guys can contribute. Um, I really want your opinions. What is the best way you think we can upload these videos moving forward? Do we continue doing the um, editing clips together um, to make a video do you like that format or do you uh, along with me do you think that it is time for a change um, something that I thought maybe we could do is um, every time we do receive an, uh, an item to unbox we edit it in at the end of another video I don't know that's just an idea um, but yeah please leave your opinions down below really this is a team effort um, so this is where you guys come in thank you very much for sitting through this I really hope you did enjoy this format either way is this a way we could do it in the future would this be a, a good way to do it permanently again please I really appreciate all of your opinions down below in the comments section please Thank you. Great news before we head off. The footage for WXW Live 9 has finally been processed. It is in my hands so I can edit the highlights video. It'll be up very, very soon. I think the footage came out very good. Great quality. The film crew did an excellent job. It has been over a month, but I think the wait will definitely be worth it for you. And the full show will be out very soon as well. So again, thank you very much for tuning into today's video. What is your favourite figure that we showed? And of course, more importantly, what is your opinion on the status of these kinds of videos? What do you think we should do with these videos in the future? Please leave all of your thoughts down below. Thank you for watching. If you haven't subscribed already, please do. We'll see you all next time. Hopefully soon.